so today we are going to discuss about supply chain and it's one of its uh, effect that causes distortion in supply chain that's pull whip effect so supply chain is composed of great number of products customers delivery points suppliers costs etc so this makes a supply chain of complex network like we are uh, you must be knowing gyroscope gyroscope is having different three x three different axes so if you give a movement in one axis other three other two are also disturbed so same is the case with the supply chain if we are uh, giving small distortion at some level it results in a big distortion at some other other level so uh, we will discuss how this actually happened so for this we will be taking some examples we will some we will be seeing some theory we will be defining the effect so first of all let me tell you what exactly the supply chain is for uh, for which we are going to study our bulb effect supply chain consists of the all the links starting from the supplier to the manufacturer ending to the retailer to the customer the cust- uh, supply chain is due uh, for fulfilling the requirement of the customer all these links work together to fulfill the requirement of a customer so components of or bits of chain in supply chain is are sorry customer then per consumer then customer then retailer then wholesaler then manufacturer then supplier to this manufacturer so this is the flow flow of material or information supply chain doesn't only involve flow of material but it also involves flow of information flow of money flow of many other things so generally we have a having a first step supply chain means transferring uh, material from one location to other that is the, that's the function of logistics it's a part of supply chain it's not the complete supply chain it's like a, a tail of elephant that we are seeing so there are many other complex the complexity complexity in the supply chain so key to un- the key to understanding supply chain is the understanding the effect of demand variation in form of ampli- amplification when it is transmitted along the logistic chain so whenever we are moving to uh, in supply chain there is a amplification that that is the in bulb uh, effect when if same information is transmitted throughout the supply chain then we will not be having any bulb effect that's that's what we require but it doesn't actually happen so that there are many times delay in communication which results in the Use fluctuation in demand, so that results in a uh, effect which, which which is known as bulb effect. Uh, I have already told you the chain is like we are having consumers, customer, retailers, then wholesalers, manufacturers, then supplier to manufacturers. If we are having small variation in the at the level of consumer or customer, this results in a huge variation or huge. that this is a huge fluctuation of the uh, demand in suppliers and of manufacturers uh, we will thank you for watching this video please subscribe to our channel for latest update and latest activity that is being carried out at this channel and please follow us on our facebook page facebook.com slash navneet e-learning hub there you can share your comments your suggestions your recommendation any requirement that you want for any particular lecture you want we'll try our best to meet your requirements thank you keep listening